Early voting starts tomorrow in Virginia with polls opening at 8 a.m. Today, election officials in Virginia Beach put their voting machines to the test, making sure they're ready for the early and absentee voting. Investigative reporter Evan Watson gives an inside look at the process. There are small steps that few people think about, but are so vital to ensuring accurate elections. Staffers in Virginia Beach checked election machines ahead of tomorrow's early voting kickoff. Good job. Even voting machines need a practice run. This is part of the integrity process. Virginia Beach election officials ran logic and accuracy tests on voting machines today, a step that's required before every election. The machines printed test ballots and results, with workers checking they count ballots correctly. A lot of people weren't interested in it too much in the past, but we're, uh, we want you to know that we always have followed these procedures. Virginia Beach Registrar Donna Patterson is aware there's more attention on the voting process right now, even though claims of widespread voter fraud last election were unfounded. There's a lot of checks and balances for everything we do. We follow the dual rule. In other words, everyone works with someone else. With early voting starting Friday, Virginia Beach election officials have already mailed out more than 5,000 absentee ballots, with thousands more to come. The trend has been increasing for years now, so we are adjusting to it. Election officials say some voters are sending in multiple request forms for an absentee ballot making it more difficult for workers to eliminate duplicates. That if you've already requested a, a ballot by mail, you don't need to fill out another application. In Virginia Beach, Evan Watson reporting for 13 News Now. You can check your registration and absentee ballot status on the Virginia Department of Elections website.